In this experiment, I'm going to do a DNA extraction. All living things have DNA in their cells, and today we're going to use kiwi fruit. So first of all, I'm going to use some washing up liquid. I'm going to put five mils into our beaker. And then we're going to use 50 mils of water. And I'm also going to add five grams of salt. So the salt the water and the washing up liquid is going to make our extraction solution. I'm then going to take a plastic bag and we're going to use half a kiwi fruit into the plastic bag. And then we're going to add our extraction solution. So that was the water, the salt and the washing up liquid. We're going to seal the bag, get rid of the air. Seal the bag and then squish up our kiwi fruit. So the extraction solution breaks open the cells and it helps the DNA to come out of the nucleus and the cell membranes. So we're just breaking down all our cells. Next, we're going to filter our kiwi solution and try and extract the DNA. So I'm going to now filter it into a clean beaker to remove all the big lumps. And I'm then going to pour about 10 mils of our solution into a fresh beaker. So you can see we've got our kiwi solution there. The next thing I want to add is some very, very cold alcohol. This has just come out of the freezer and we're going to add this to the top of our kiwi solution. So the alcohol precipitates all the DNA and it makes it all clump together. So if we have a look we can see in the alcohol layer, we've got lots of white strands and I'm going to use a loop to pull these out and we'll have a closer look.
So you can see the DNA is all clumped together in the alcohol layer. And if we squash it out in the bag, we can see we've got long kind of fibrous material in there. is the DNA.